Oh boy, I can't wait to watch this. That's about dinosaurs. Yeah, I love dinosaurs. You watched our new movie, right? With Jurassic World? Yeah. Check out the review for it. He obviously loved it. Ooh, ah, uh, what are we watching now? Maybe something Godzilla? Nah, I'm kidding. It's more dinosaur stuff for you guys. Stay tuned. Today's episode is about extreme dinosaurs. It's the extreme dinosaurs. So they must have just got rid of their collection. Uh, I've never had these. I used to love street sharks as a kid. I had street sharks. Didn't even know there was an extreme dinosaur version. You know how it was when you're young. You go from one thing to another pretty quickly. You go from turtles to Power Rangers to like everything. It can change within just a time frame all within a year. <laughs> But I was like, when I heard about these, obviously later in my adulthood, I'm like, oh my gosh, these are pretty neat. And uh, I know there's like those dog versions. I think those are ugly, so I have no interest in those. I showed you, if you go check out past video, we had a toy store where we found them. It was like $500 for one of those. And I'm like, oh, I just think they're ugly. Now these look cool. The street stars look cool. And uh, like this guy right here. Uh, let me know in the comments below what you thought about street sharks, about extreme dinosaurs. Stuff like that. But here's this guy here. And it's funny, when we got him, we'll move on to the next guy, but he's pretty cool. They got a little bit of dirt and some of them, so they need to be just washed up a little bit, but they're pretty neat. We can put him in the background there. Then we got this guy. So someone must have just gotten rid of their collection, and uh, it was like good, t good place, good time that day. We went right around the places, so we were at the right place at the right time, so we were pretty happy. Because we went to another couple places and we found awesome stuff there. Those will be in other videos. This one we're focused on the Extreme Dinosaurs. So what we got from this location, this in a mall of, of V-Stock. And we had a thing where it was like, buy two, get one. So we got six figures all together. So two of them were free. So it awesomely, awesomely and awesomely together has one. Changed the, uh, made these definitely even cheaper and more worth. And they look like they're pretty decent condition. So except for a few like web cobwebs dirt dust and a couple of things that were stuck to them and stuff but it's nothing too bad you can just clean them as i said i don't know if any of most of these guys will stay in but there's this guy he looks pretty cool looking like i think these look amazing these look really neat and when we went there the girl to check it's like wow we just put these up today i was like this morning i was like good thing we got in there and then the next place we'll have in a video, we went there and we picked out some cool finds. We're like, oh my gosh, we can't go without these. And they're like, wow, we just put this out this morning. It's like, what a day. <laughs> so we finally lucked out with some cool things there. And these were pretty, pretty nicely priced, I have to say. They were nicely, nicely priced for these. Look how cool he looks. He looks cool. Got this little marking on him. On his back and all that. Again, look at his uh, stuff there, and the T-Rex guys over there. Next up, uh, where'd he go? There he is. He's up in the front. The Triceratops one. How are you doing up there, buddy? Doing pretty good, buddy. <laughs> but yeah, I hope you like this. Uh, more cool stuff. Let us know what you think of these again, and don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Pretty, pretty neat stuff to find, and hope... Hope you enjoy it, and we have a lot more fun here, a lot more collectibles, board games, and other stuff on the way. But look at him, he looks pretty cool. I think he looks really awesome. I love the face on these things. They look amazing. I mean, just look at that. I don't know if I can get a better shot of him, but look at all that. He looks cool. Just like I thought, you know, they got the, he's got the chain wrapped around him on his arms. For his belt, and just look at those faces. Good detail. They look so creative and cool sculpted. <laughs> and last but not least, I'm pretty sure he's supposed to have wings. But it's like, you take what you can get. Maybe somewhere someone will have uh, wings of them. But there's like a pterodactyl guy, pteranodon guy. Looks pretty badass. These are effing amazing. I think so. And what's cool about this guy here is, probably talked a little too close to the mic, but his head does this. So I'm sure you can like, I'm sure back there or something for that. But I like this. The mouth 
kind of they look so gnarly and awesome they look so wow i think so and that's basically it for this oh yeah i forgot we also got this down in front buddy sorry I love the movie Turtles. As a kid, I didn't mind the third movie. But I had, you know, you had the cool figures with them in the Sam Raffet. They had the little scepter for the time travel. All that stuff there. Well, at this same thing, that's, this was our sixth figure. And it was April from the movie and card. So an even more pricing to get her. There's that. You know, and then there's... The little card thing there to show off so that's kind of neat how it has that little scene in the back there i think that's pretty cool honestly that part right there and there's the rest of it all that and then there she is because i don't think and it's still technically that's not punched out it's a little moving but it's not punched out so new Turtles 3, they look pretty cool. I saw that they look kind of cool. I like the little samurai stuff. I love the fact that they actually tried to do something different, something new, instead of just rehashing 1 and 2 again. And there's their accessories. There's the scepter. And there's April. So a bonus for our month of April celebration, even though it's not April anymore. <laughs> there she is. I don't think I had April. I know I had the Turtles, and I didn't have like any of the other big stuff, but I just wanted the Turtles mainly. And there she is, looking pretty cool, I'd say. From the movie 3. And I dropped her. Oh, well. <laughs> What's up, dude? Totally, man. Maybe even... Say it. Gnarly? Eh. Let's go. I'm getting out of here. Uh, luckily, this bag of upcoming things to show off broke my fall. See you later, everyone. Stay gnarly. <sighs> He's making me say it now, too. Cowabunga? Oh, yeah, we also got some Sonic figures that day. Figure we'll end it on this. I know, right? <laughs> some from the Sonic 2 movie and then Sonic with his broken leg. But it was a bag that was a dollar. So, can't complain too much. Because it also had him. This Knuckles, not a racing one. Uh, this Tails, those little twirly butt in his tails. And the uh, golden Super Saiyan Sonic. So, yeah, I did it for the day. See you, everyone. <laughs> Hope you liked it. Thanks for watching, and uh, we'll see you next time. Thanks, everyone. I don't care. Race me. I don't want to. Race me. Fine, I'll beat your ass in a race. <sighs> yeah, that does seem like a fun thing to fly around in. We should have thought about that too. Maybe ride around in saucers or something. Yeah. <sighs> I'd join you guys, but I'm stuck in plastic. Oh well. Later. Burp.